The chickens would, would send us home. A chicken. I personally, every single time when I asked someone and you guys thought it was okay, I thought it needed a lot more time. Alex needs to be up for elimination. He didn't communicate and he let a raw chicken walk. But there's also other stations that are like miscommunicating and trying to rush orders. I mean, gar garnish. In my defense also to communication from yeah. that meat. I know I fucked up, but I don't deserve to be up for elimination. I didn't cook raw chicken tonight. I'm not giving up whatsoever. All right, let's, this is gonna have to be a vote. Uh, uh, this will have to be a vote. I, I'll, I'll nominate myself first. Meat is my station as well, so I gotta be up there with you. Antonio is this fucking leader, but he nominated himself. Moving forward, what's your, what's your vote? Jay? I have to say Jay and you. Okay. Peyton? I say Jay and Antonio. Why, why me, though? I didn't understand. What, what did I? You even nominated yourself, bro. First thing you said was, I'm not a I'm going to nominate myself. I, no, you, I did not Antonio, say that. I heard I'm just going to nominate myself. myself. I didn't nominate myself. I said we're going to vote. That's what I heard at first. No, I didn't say I nominate myself. I said we got to nominate. No, I did not nominate myself. No. No, all I said was, let's take a vote. Who are we going to nominate? You watch. What? Go back and watch that shit. I'll, I'll nominate myself first. It was my station as well, so I gotta be up there with you. I heard, I heard, I nominate myself. That's what I heard. Like, why me I first? Mean, I mean, I'll be, I'll be honest. I, I honestly understood that as well, man. I mean, I, if, if, I guess you want me to go home. That's cool. That's not what I'm saying. Antonio said I nominate myself. Then he got super defensive. So in that case alone, I don't know if I could trust him that much. This is nothing fucking personal. But do we gotta like sit out here and sing fucking kumbaya? We all know what we came here for, man. People are gonna have to go home. Be on your toes when we're out there because none of us are safe. Blue team, have you reached a decision? Yes, yes chef. chef. Thank God for that. Peyton. Yes, Chef. Blue team's first nominee and why? Uh, chef, our first nomination uh, is Alex. Alex, why? He's taken responsibility for the, uh, the last piece of chicken that went out that was raw. The blue team's second nominee. Our second nominee is Jay. Why? Jay seemed to be struggling on the uh, garnish station. Certain points when we were ready with our proteins, um, he didn't have garnish working. OK. Jay, Alex, step forward, please. Hurry up. I am not in a fucking good mood tonight for bullshit. Jay, why was it so difficult tonight? Communication just come from the meat station. It was messing me up, and I definitely came just a little unprepared today. Is that right? The meat station screwed the garnish station tonight. I, it, got, it became really overwhelming once the chicken, you know, started becoming ordered in. Can you cook chicken? Yes, chef, I can cook chicken. I know I can cook chicken. Behind you is an array of talent that could easily identify the chicken's cooked or not, right? Yes, chef. So did they also tell you it was cooked? Yes, I communicated with them and asked them oh as well, and they God. agreed so with me. What you're saying that nobody behind you can cook a chicken now as well? Yes, chef. Who told you it was cooked? Uh, Antonio. Antonio, oh my God. Antonio, fucking come up here. I didn't touch that chicken, Chef. So who told Alex the chicken was cooked? Whoever pulled him. Names, please. Trenton. Trenton, come up here, you. What the fuck is going on? You told him the chicken was cooked. Absolutely not. Oh, my God. Chef, I did. I, oh, so my I, Lord. I fired, I fired the chicken. He was behind. I put I'm the chicken in the pan. I'm going to for 30 seconds. I want to come down, and you fucking tell me the truth. Chicken game. Fuck. Who checked the chickens? I never I didn't touch them. the chickens once they came out of the oven. Who hey, touched who, the chicken? Who, the who touched it? It never got touched. Who took them to the pass? I know I sure fucking didn't. Alex, did you take them to the pass? Sam, I'm pretty sure you ran the chicken. I didn't put them to the pass because I put them in front of you. I'm pretty sure I had you run the chicken. Fucking remember, who ran the chicken? I guarantee you, you ran the chicken. No one, no, honestly. Yeah, like, this is fucking ridiculous. Jesus Christ. Shop. He's coming. Oh, boy. 
This is not normal. Let's start again. Alex, who told you the chicken was cooked? Sam. Sam? Oh, my God. Sam, come up here, you. Yes, Chef. So you told him the chicken was cooked? I did not touch the chicken. I pulled it from the oven, and I did not touch it. Well, you should have touched it. If you pull it from the oven, you should touch it. I agree. I should I have touched it from the oven. I didn't feel comfortable that that was cooked. How about this, Alex? Keeping fucking control of your chicken. Yes, Chef. Unbelievable. So now we got to the bottom of Chicken Gate. You opened up the oven, pulled them out, didn't even think of checking them, and handed them to Alex. Yes, Chef. Oh, my Lord. Now that is teamwork, not. Trent is back in line and turning fuck off back in line. Sam, don't commit to something you're not in control and you're not prepared to follow through with. Yes, Chef. Back in line. Alex, 10 seconds. Why do you think you should stay in Hell's Kitchen? I think I should stay in Hell's Kitchen because I came here for a reason and I'm not backing down. I know that I have a good fight in myself and I want to keep learning from you, Chef. Jay, 10 seconds. Why should you stay in Hell's Kitchen? Chef, you know that I have voice, you know that I have drive, you know that I have skill. Communication was definitely a little bit off. I had a rough day, came in a little bit unprepared, but I definitely picked myself up and definitely was speeding up and getting ready to go. My decision is? Jay, take off your jacket, young man. Your time is done. You know, if you can't get the garnish right, you've got no chance of becoming my head chef. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Good night. I'm definitely pissed off right now. You know, at least I was honest about my mistakes. I think Alex should have been the one going home tonight. But this is definitely not the last time the world has seen Chef J.I. I'm definitely going to go home and I'm going to bounce back. I'm going to keep moving forward and do what I'm meant to do, cook. Alex. Yes, Chef. Have the confidence to stand by your own technique. And more importantly, don't panic under pressure. Yes, Chef. Is that clear? Yes, Chef. Back in line. Now, piss off. Yes, Chef. chef. Wrong way, Alex. Holy fuck. I'm not trying to make any enemies on this team at all, but I'm very annoyed with Sam. I, I felt like he was only thinking about himself, but the past is the past, and we just have to move forward together as a team. Ladies, good night. Good night, good night Chef. Keep it up, or you're going to the blue team. Oh, God. The fucking blue team need to get their shit together. Constantly sounds like nobody knows what the fuck's going on. Moving forward, red team is definitely gonna kill it. Nah, I need like five seconds before I lose my shit. Right now, I'm feeling pretty pissed off and rather furious. Alex just played the blame game, calling three other people up with you. Alex needs to own his station and own the, own the product that he's cooking. I'm dead set that Alex is going home next. After watching Jay struggle so badly on Garnish, I decided to assign him to a different station, the train station.